Welcome, welcome, welcome to another episode of Pokemon Shield Nuzlocke Challenge! Yes, we're back again! And in the last episode, we defeated Raihan. Yes, we now conquered all eight gyms. We did it! And now we're... Some shenanigans is going on in Rose Tower, and we're here to put a stop to it, whatever it is. So, yeah, it's doing pretty well. It's doing pretty well. So, yeah, so, um, in the last episode, we, we faced up against Raihan, like I said. And our new Tara went absolutely ham on him. I think she took out pretty much his entire team. Zara went absolutely ham. So hopefully we get to go in. Um, big bad is Olina. So I'm hoping Olina is a decent, like, is a decent go through. I know she, well, she doesn't really prioritize in steel type Pokemon. It's more, um, it's more of a, it's more roses category. All right, let's head off with a bit of fire spin. Wow, Durant goes first. Okay, cool. It's gonna be even faster. Right, cool. Do the trick for a one shot, and of course, it's Tachi is the boy. Is the boy. Tachi's just a brilliant, brilliant fire type, dude. He's a brilliant fire type. Snuff went to 56, which is fantastic. Cool. Um, also, I have no clue what Olina starts with. I have no clue anything. I've got nothing close. I've got nothing close of what Olina starts with. I just know she's got one Milotic, um, a Salazzle, and her, her ace is Gigantamax Scarbodo. That's all I know. That is literally all I know about Olina. I don't know who, anything else. Ooh. Ooh. Very nice. Very nice transition as well. That was, that's pretty good. All right, is this going to be a gauntlet between me and Hop now? So me and Hop are just going to... Just going to kind of go through people one by one. I might as well use this time to check on um, who we're going to be facing. Right, cool. So yeah, it's, it's basically a gauntlet. It's basically gonna be a fat gauntlet. Right, let's go with Pokemon Olina. What does she know? What does she know? Right, so in the games, her team consists of a Frostlass, a Serena, Salazzle, Milotic, and Garboda. Okay, so Frostlass would be first. Um, Rockley can take care of that very, very easily. Um, being ice type and us being rock and go or rock and fire, we can do that very very easily. Cool. Touch this next one. Oh yeah, we were top. I forgot. I, I was like double. When did we get double? But yeah, no. Uh, okay, cool. So I'm gonna say maybe get that bronze on. I feel like bronze on is gonna give me more issues, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go for the bronze on. Nice. Um, so yeah, so Frost is first. Rockley can take care of that. Um, next Serena, Rockley can take care of that as well. Um, well actually no, I'd feel better putting in Katachi to be honest. Um, for Salazzle being a poison and fire type, we could put in Katara, because obviously that is two typings that we can counter, water and ground. Um, Milotic, Zeus has got that wrapped. And then for Garboda, it'd be Katara again, wouldn't it? For straight up ground type, so yeah. It'd be, it'd be pretty good, it'd be alright. We'd be okay. So it seems like a pretty well-rounded team. Um, no one's got any out of the out of the nowhere type move so we, we should be okay right okay so obviously we both miss because they do dig at least we both know we go first so that would help uh, ooh, not exactly the best hit to get not exactly the best to get hit with not gonna lie I'm not gonna lie to you right hopefully fire spin is a one shot no but double should make that uh double should should take care of that oh brilliant good job hop fantastic Fantastic, you beautiful, beautiful beast. Alright, is Ice Pop gonna level up? No, that was a pretty fast match. Pretty quickly. But I think Hop heals us every time, so, so we're good. At least at least Itachi goes through it quickly. At least Itachi gets, yeah. Itachi just goes ham with this. He goes absolutely ballistic. Alright, so normally in game logic, it's a, it's a gauntlet of three. So most likely we got two more teams to face. But my god man, Rose Tower is it's freaking huge. I wonder what happens in all like these separate floors. I wonder what happens in a company like that. Just all these different floors going like just seem to be countless. Oh man. Come on then, let's go. Are they insurance? They just said they're in MC Insurance? MC Insurance? Huh. Oh Ma Macro Cosmos? Is that the team? Macro Cosmos? That's a bit of a weird name, I'm not gonna lie. Macro Cosmos. Huh. 
Who knew? Right, um, I'll definitely get rid of Morwile. Morwile's got Crunch. In in our fat history of going up against Morwiles, Crunch has not been the best. So, Itachi, overheat please. And a bit of a Morwile, so... Thank you. Just a straight up one shot, dude. Overheat, takes out everybody. Everyone. Absolutely everyone. I don't think I've seen one person take an overheat and survive. Like, I've, it's been it's been pretty hard to see so far. Right, so Double's got Reversal, that's gonna be super effective again. Okay, well, oh, Reversal is dependent on HP, isn't it? Okay, um, Shift Gear, which is Speed? Yep, Speed. And Attack, ooh, Speed and Attack, very aggressive. But Fire Spin should be able to take care of you very nicely. Unless you go first. But you get Hop, so it's fine. Hop's not part of our challenge, so it's fine. Oh, it's a multiple hit move. Whoa. It's a multiple hit move, really? That's a pretty chunky move to be two hits or multiple hits. That's very chunky. Oh man. But yeah, I had a bit of a, a bit of an issue before starting recording and stuff. Dude, I was like, I I can't find a battery to go with my uh, Pro Controller because I've got the wireless one. Or well, I say wireless one, I got three powered one. But dude, I couldn't find the other battery to go with my Joy-Cons and I had such a problem with Joy-Cons today. Like I'm just I'm just not I'm 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 not dealing with it. There's a problem with Joy-Cons. It's not good. It's really not good. Like I tried getting them out. They obviously wouldn't attach. They wouldn't attach for some reason. Even though I clicked them in, did everything, they just wouldn't attach. The first ones that I put in um, just stayed there, but they're getting drift now. Fantastic. So it's just they're, they're all going wrong. Everything with Joy-Cons is going wrong. I swear, Nintendo needs to like release like I don't know. Joy-Cons version 2, or like, I don't know, Joy-Con Evolution, or something. Just something decent, because the Joy-Cons are not good, dude. With the amount of game time that a normal gamer would do, like, they need to be durable. They really, really do need to be durable. Like, even if you take, like, I don't know, a Pro Controller and, like, split it in half, like, even that, you don't really get much, like, you don't get any drift. Once a control, once, like, a Pro Controller dies, it's gone. Like, it is flat out gone. You don't need the drift. The drift is really, really annoying. Like, I get it's a whole bunch of technical stuff that, you know, it's a bit hard to comprehend and stuff like that, but it's really, really difficult. Oof. Stump Fist and Steel it. Steel and Rock and Steel and Ground. So, I'd feel better if Snurps came out for this one. Or Rockley. Actually, no, not Rockley. I'd feel better. Oh, I mean... Even Katara would do well. Rock and ground. Yeah, Katara would do better, I suppose. I could put in Snurps anyway. If if Katara comes out pretty badly, I could just bring out Snurps. Snurps can take a pretty good hit. Right, what do Snurps on? Stunfisk. Doesn't do much. But it does paralyze him, so that's a good point. Good job, Hop. Rock slide. Uh, yeah, that wouldn't be bad on Sachi. Move. Katara just doesn't get phased man this girl does not get phased absolutely not right bounce since when does stun fist not bounce all right well muddy water on steelix might as well right at least we both get to tag team on the steelix which is great paralysis would help maybe but of course not right muddy water stun fist obviously avoided it but steelix doesn't which is who we're trying to fight over time right now look at that katara just absolutely destroying opponents. Absolutely destroying the competition. She's so, she's just so ballistic, dude. And he got caught in the paralysis, which is fantastic. Right, it's part ground, isn't it? So I'm going to say Muddy Water again. Um, but yeah, it's, it's oh, Katara. Just, I, I'm so proud of Katara. Uh, just, 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 I'm so proud of Katara. Just the Look at it. Is it super effective? Yes, it is. No one survives Katara. The best waterbender in the world. No one can surpass Katara. Oh, fantastic. I'm so happy. I'm so happy with this. I'm so happy with Katara. It's such a good find. Okay, cool. So that should be the trial of three, which means Olina should be next. All right, so she starts off with Frostlass. I hope I can change my Pokemon. That would be really nice, because I'm, I'm not going to lie. I'm going to have a little bit of a panic attack. Okay, good. Gonna have a bit of a panic if I had to start off with the Taji. But okay, cool. So Rockley starts up first. Ice and rock ice and ghost type. Rockley should be okay. We're good. We're good to go. We are completely fine. Cool. Welcome to Chairman Rose's exclusive space. Here oh crap, I pressed B too way too early. So, 
You got through all of the special staff that I ordered to stop you. I would expect nothing less of the trainers handpaid by Champion Leon himself. But I'm afraid it is now time for you to go home. Because... I will not allow you to stop the great Champion Rose. You shall be the first to get to. If I have to beat you to pieces, then the Champion will have no other one thus and will thus lose heart. In that state, he will listen to anything the Champion says. Wow, she's, uh, she's, a, bit of a, she's a bit of a psycho, isn't she? She's a, bit of a, she's a bit of a wild card, isn't she? Okay, cool. Good shout. Started off with has got the good shout. It's all about the first Pokemon, dude. It's all about the first Pokemon. Right, awesome. Then, are we heavier? Are we that heavier? I, I'm, I think we're that heavier. Oh, it goes first. And it's a double team. Oh, oh, oh why'd it have to be double team? Did we hit it? Yes, we still hit it. Fantastic. Is that... Are we going to get it in one shot? Oh, of course we are. Broccoli's got this. It's a chunky boy. He is our chunky boy. He's our chungus. Biggest, thickest. He's our biggest, thickest. Alright, who's next? It's Milotic. Zeus, get your butt in here, dude. We need some help. Thunderbolt should be good. Well, I mean, we got Snurps and Zeus, so we're good on both ends, to be honest. We're good on both ends. Um, I don't think it knows any ground type moves. I don't think it knows any ice type moves. So either way, it would have been good for both of them. So let's see. Let's see Thunderbolt. Let's just Thunderbolt. One shot again. Fantastic. Wanna crit? Zeus is spoiling me, dude. You see, absolutely. Oh, Zeus, you're spoiling me, chat. Right, let's go. Who you got next? Salazzle. Uh, to be honest, I could have kept. I can keep it. I mean, I can keep it. Uh, Zeus, but you know what? Katara, show, show Alina the power of what it took to do your power. Just, just show off. Go on, Katara, just show off. Right, nice little Earth power, and we should be good. Right, Earth power. Right, poison gas. Ooh, are we gonna get poisoned with that? No. Uh, but we need Earth for Garboda. Uh, that's not right. That's not right. Well, at least we got one shot, so that's it anyway. Alright, we can take Katara back for one for one go. Alright, what are we missing? Who are we missing? We're missing someone. What? Whoa, that's a big poison! That was a big, big poison! Whoa! Alright, Serena, we've got Rockley, got Tachi, and we've got Ice Pop. Hey! Itachi. Itachi's been on a roll so far. One overheat and we should be good. I just, I love that we got Chandelure. I think this is the first time I actually got Chandelure on my team. I've always seen Chandelure from like a distance. I'm just like, I, I would love to have you. Uh, but he's always been like overshadowed for Gengar because obviously Gengar's just my favorite Pokemon. Like, so I've always gone for a Gengar instead. I just, this is like the first time I've had to go through a playthrough and not try and go for a Gengar. Cool, Katara went to 53, is she gonna learn anything? Memento is Memento's not really that decent, is it? The user faints when using the Ha no! No 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 no. User faints? No, I don't think so. Garboda, last Pokemon. Uh Katara, let's try and gosh man, I could I could put in Katara, but with the poisoning, I don't know. I could put in Zeus and just go with Bulldoze instead. Um Let's go with Zeus instead, because I don't, I'm not, I'm not keen, I'm not really keen on the, you know, on the poisoning, because that was a huge chunk of poisoning that got taken away. That was a huge chunk of health that got taken away by poison. Right, cool. Dynamax, Max Quake, it's our only super effective move, so let's go. It's the only super effective move we got. Oh man, it's all enough, let's do this. Right, come on, Zeus. Dun, 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 dun. Let's go, baby! Big boy Zeus. Big boy Zeus. I wonder who they I wonder what they did to kinda like, you know, choose who got Dynamax. I, I understand the Gen 8 Pokemon, because obviously that's like that you need the feature and you need the Pokemon to stand up feature. Uh, I get that. I get I get it. But like the old Pokemon who get Gigantamax, I wonder how they decide that. I wonder if they generally look at like the entire like roster and go like you know what everyone pick one 
Like everyone pick their favorite and then we'll just choose like, I don't know, five or six or whatever. Oof, third HP. Get a Sandstorm out of it. Um, raise up special defense, which should be good. Weak armor, which makes it lower defense, but makes him faster. That's still fine. Oh crap, they've got Max Quick of their own. No, Zeus, they've got Max Quick of their own. I can believe we've got him. No, Zeus! Oh no. If we can get this, if we can get this, we can't switch out. We can't tag out. I can't, I can't tag anybody out. Katara, no. Oh my god, I can actually tag out. Oh great, why did I do this? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Then how come going back to Kabu's match, how come we couldn't do it then? Wait a minute. So that means... So wait, 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 wait. So you're telling me I had to, I could swap out my Pokemon all this time. But when I tried to do it in Kabu's match, I wasn't allowed. How does that work? How does that work? So what the hell, man? How come I couldn't... That makes no sense. That makes absolutely no sense. And also, oh no, but ground type, I'm gonna get done in by ground type. Attaching, I'm gonna get done in as well. Oh God, is... Can Ice Pop take it? Can Ice Pop take that? Um, can Ice Pop take it? If it does, if it does its rock attack. Uh, that's the thing, if it does its rock attack, I'm not gonna make it. If Katara can do a really big earth power, we can take it as well. Right, I'm gonna say Ice... Oh, I don't really wanna get rid of Ice Pop. I don't wanna get one. I don't wanna get rid of anyone, but Katara's not gonna... Katara with the poisoning is not gonna be able to take it. Not but no way. She's not gonna be able to take it. So one more max quake. And then I could try and spam up Blizzard and stuff. Oh fantastic. That's beautiful fine. That is perfectly fine. I'm happy with that. I'm content with that. It's perfectly fine. Cool. Sick. Right. But yeah, so how come so ages ago, yeah, if it doesn't be like just coming in now, right? We literally the, like a few episodes back, like, way, 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 way back, when we faced off against Kabu, we went through a whole big match, right? And we lost, um, we lost Epona on Mudbray, a Pokemon that I personally loved on our team, the out of Dynamax. Why now was we able to switch? That makes no sense. How come now we were able to switch? But back then, when I was trying to take Mud, when I was trying to take Epona out of the active, we couldn't. That makes zero sense. Right, let's go Aurora Beam. That makes zero sense. I'm, no, I'm really mad about that. That means all this time you're telling me... Oh, crap. That means you're telling me all this time we could have kept Epona. After all of this time, we could have kept Epona. But we couldn't. That's annoying. That is so annoying. Right, I think Rock Lee can take a hit. Rock Lee should be able to take a very, very decent hit. I doubt it's going to be... I doubt he's going to do a Poison type or the Ground type move. I really doubt it. And his defense is pretty good. So you know what, Rock Lee? I have faith in you, dude, to tank one hit. And then we're good. We are good. I, that's got me so mad. It's got me really, really mad. I know it's the poisoning as well, but dude, that got me so mad. So wait a minute, I need to check this out. Does G Max, um, does Center Scorch's G Max attack stop me from retreating? That's the one thing I need to figure out. Because if it doesn't, then some some shenanigans really, really went wrong, and I'm so mad. Right, please don't be a lot of poisoning. No, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. As, as long as we go first, as long as we go first, as long as we go first, of course not. Rock Lee, come on dude, you can tank it, I know you can, I know you can tank it, I know you can! Yes! Fantastic. Boy. He is the boy. Rock Lee is our tank. You want a tank? There is no one better than Rock Lee. Absolutely no one. But dude, that got me so mad. That's got me so, so mad. Wait a minute, I need to figure this, I need to search this out. Can, does Center Scorch's G-Max attack? What is it? G-Max Centerferno, right? Centerferno. 
If it stop, if we can't retreat from that, then I'll I'll accept it. But if it doesn't say anything, I'm not being able to retreat. I'm gonna be so freaking mad. I'm gonna be so mad. Right, what does it do? What does it do? Effect. GMX Center Phone inflicts damage and binds the target for four turns. The binding effect is similar to Fire Spin, except that it doesn't end prematurely if the user switches out or faints. Its powers with so so we can't switch out? Is that what it's telling me? Is that what it's telling me? It can't it, it can't switch out basically. Ah oh, man, are you seriously? Ah oh, man, that's not so does bind oh, you know what we gotta search up Pokemon Pokemon Bind move. Oh god damn it. God damn it man. Right, what does bind do? It works similarly to bind it said, right? Right, effect. Bind does damage for two to five turns. There's a 37 point... Oh, screw it, man. It's law. I don't care. There's a 37.5% chance that it will attack for two turns. Blah, blah, blah. It's all technicality stuff. Can I, can I leave? Am I allowed to leave? Um, if the user switches out before the turn duration ends, the target will be unable to attack during that turn. Since it did not get to select a move, if the target switches out before the turn duration ends, bind will automatically be used again. So we can switch out then. So you're telling me it work so it works similarly to bind. It literally said nothing about retreating. And it said it works similarly to bind, which still allows us to retreat. So you're telling me that for some unknown reason, we were not we weren't able to get Epona out of the active. I'm so mad about that. I'm so freaking mad. What was that? <laughs> like, what was that? Nah, dude, I'm gonna, I'm, dude, I gotta look back on that episode, dude, because I'm so freaking mad. I am so freaking mad right now. How can you tell me? How can you tell me that I wasn't able to tag out? Does the buggy terrain do it? Does the bug terrain do anything? No, of course not, because then we could, we could have left. No, wait, does the bug, does like a buggy terrain work or something? That makes no sense, it makes zero sense. I can't, I, I, my, I'm so blown, my mind is blown right now. I am so mad about this. I'm really, really mad. Oh my God. That's so crazy, that is crazy. Oh my God, I want a, I want a clause on that. I want a freebie. But I, I'm, just, I'm being a bit of a so-and-so for asking for a freebie, but I'm so freaking mad. We deserve, we deserve enrightment. Um, no, I can get there myself because we need stuff to do. Oh my God, that is so annoying. Right, so who's next? Bead, right? Bead is next. Um, right, so Bead would be next. He's got only two. No, he does have a couple of fairy type Pokemon. Um, God, that is a bit of a gamble. I know he's got. Does he start off with Mawile or Galarian Ponyta or Galarian Rapidash? Um, he starts off with one of the two, and I can't remember for the life of me which one he starts off with. Um, if he starts off with Mawile, then Rockley's got this. If he starts off with Rapidash, I'm gonna have to swap out and make way for Itachi. Ah, that's gonna be so difficult. I'm gonna go off on a limb and says he starts off with more while. I'm gonna say more while. I don't know if that's gonna be right or not. But ugh, gosh, man, that's gonna be so stressful. Right, it's our last rematch. It's the last rematch against Speed. And my God, we we better come out on this. We better come out. Okay, hey Hop. Uh, wait, is he gonna challenge me again? Nah, he can't do. He can't do. We don't challenge Hop again until the ending, right? This is it. Here at Winton Stadium, the greatest stadium in all Galar. You're gonna show everyone the greatest battle ever, mate, and set the world on fire. All right. The only thing that I'm really scared about is um is Alistar. That that's literally. I'm really freaked out about Alistar. Right. Um. Okay. Or I really want to check. Um, the Champions Cup just to make sure that we've got this okay so if it's the Champions Cup oh gosh I'm really I'm really worried because if we go in preparing for bead and it's somebody else I'm not gonna lie to you I'm gonna be a bit 
gonna be a bit uh gonna be a bit down hard done by it. Right, cool. So right, sweet. Alright, so Bead has more while oh god man, what a gym to have. A psychic and fairy gym leader. That's like the first dual typing leader. That's crazy. Kabu, you absolute just waste of space, dude. Absolute waste of space. I can't believe that. Um, we're not allowed. I can't believe we're not allowed. D dude, I'm gonna hold that. I'm going to hold that. I'm gonna be so freaking. I'm so freaking mad. God damn it, man. Right, come on, Bead. Let's go. Let's do this thing. Our last rematch against Bead. Let's go. Right. Yes. We have a score to settle. We do have a score to settle, Bead. And I'm very... I'm... Ah, man, I'm waiting. I'm waiting. Alright, let's go. We're gonna get him. We're gonna get him. The final revenge. Here we go. Let's go, dude. I'm ready. I'm ready. Sorry. My, I, I went into like pop up concentration mode for a second. Oh man, this is gonna be this is gonna be intense. This is gonna be very very intense. Right, um, it's gonna be a mixture of Rockley, Ice Pop, and Itachi. Them three are gonna be very very essential. Right, Heat Crash without a doubt because we're obviously heavier. We are way heavier. One shot. Let's go, baby. Let's do this. We're right, starting hard, man. Let's go. Let's go. I'm not wasting any time. It's the final revenge, dude. It's the final revenge. I'm ready for you. Right, God of War, Psychic and Fairy, Ice Pop can come in with a bit of a bug buzz. Cause I wanna keep I do wanna keep Itachi. I do really wanna keep Itachi though. Um Cool, I'm fine with that. Itachi. I'll, Itachi is used to the end. I think I'll use it at the end. Okay, let's go. Just spam out bug buzz. Alright, come on, God of War, let's see what you got. Let's see what you got. What moveset? Dazzling Gleam, Psychic, Calm. Okay, cool. We've got those now. We've got those. No, the Joy-Cons! Ah! The Joy-Cons really messed me up, man. Oh, my God. I'm s I can't stand these Joy-Cons. I can't. I hate it. I hate these Joy-Cons. Oh, my God. I can't. I can't. If I lose Ice Pop now, I swear to God, I'm going to be so freaking mad. God, right, Rock Glee, I'm sorry dude, you gotta come back in. Cause we decided, it just so happened, it's just so happened to, to, to oh man. So mad, I'm so, I'm so mad, I'm so freaking mad. As if we let her get away with this. I know it wasn't super effective either, but oh my God, dude, seriously. If I don't get Guard in this next hit, I'm gonna lose Rock Glee. And Rock Lee is my ace against Leon's Charizard. If I don't get, I need to find a Pokemon that can get rid of her in one shot. Itachi can do it, but he's gonna have to take a Psychic to do it, and he's gonna need the rest of them to do it. I could do Snurps. Actually, I could do Snurps. Snurps should be faster. Frenzy Plant should do a fair bit. All right, Snurps, come on, man. I can't believe Joy Cons. Oh my god! I literally went to go to I literally went to go down to Buzz Buzz, and I saw I saw the delay, and I got so freaking mad. Right, Frenzy Plant should uh, should do it. Come on, just hit it, just hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it, please. Frenzy Plant, yes. Come on, this should be it. This should be it. Yes. Nice. 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 Cool. Right, cool. Snapple, Ice Pop, and Rock Lee all went up. Alright, cool. Next one is Rapidash. Then that should be. Right, what is it? No, Psycho Cut. Take down, Dazzling Gleam, and Quick Attack. Quick Attack won't do anything. Because obviously Itachi is normal type. Take down won't do anything. It's just Dazzling Gleam and Psycho Cut. A Psychic type move will do half damage. And Dazzling Gleam, a Fairy type move, will do normal damage. But his special defense is really on point. Itachi's special defense is pretty good. Right. If I can get Rapidash out in one go, in one Shadow Ball, 
It's made. It, we've done it. All we gotta do is just don't, oh, don't screw me over. I literally just spam A. I literally went to go for A a good handful of times. Okay, cool. Atachi can take it. That's good. One Shadow Ball. That's all I need. One Shadow Ball. Just one. Just one. And one's all I need. One is literally all I need. Right. I'm pretty confident that Itachi can take it with the health that he's got. I need to just level it up as well. So I'm pre I'm fairly confident that he can take it. Right, Hatterene. I'm I'm fairly confident that he can take at least one move. I'm pretty sure that this G Mac uh, that the Dynamax hit will, will take it out in one go. I'm I want to be sure. Right, fight. Dynamax. Max Phantasm. Low lower defense. Right. I want to I want to be sure. I want to be sure. Please, this should be a one-shot effort. This should be a one-shot effort. Atachi can take it. I know he can do it. G-Max Dazzling Gleam. If, I can, if I'm lucky enough to go first, but I don't think Atachi's going to be that quick. I don't think Itachi's going to be that quick to go first. I'm not going to lie to you. I don't think he is. Oh, wait, he is. Is it going to be one-shot? Itachi. Itachi, you are Golden Child, the, the big three of my team right now. Snurple, Rock Lee, and Itachi. Those three are the top three. We did it. Revenge. The last revenge. Oh. Almost. We almost let it slip. Almost let it slip. I'm not going through this again with these janky, these janky, janky, janky Joy Cons, dude. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. Do you know how much heart attack I had? Like, we literally let it slip. We fully let it slip. To be fair, I'm pretty sure Itachi could have swiped out Gardevoir and the other two. And he did. He got two out of three of them. But then again, I didn't really bring in anybody else. So, right. Let's heal up everybody. Oh, everyone's already healed. Right. Well, I think in that case, I'm going to leave it for there. We're going to leave... So, that was a good little way to end it. The last revenge we done it was great. match, I think, is the rematch, which is great. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna thank you guys so much for watching this episode. Um, next time we face off against Nessa, uh, which should be pretty cool for that. Snurps and Zeus are gonna be our boys for that one, so we should be pretty good. Then we've got Alistar, which is gonna be a, another tiny bit of a challenge, but Snurps should take it. Um, but yeah, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, yeah, if you guys enjoyed, always click like and always click the video, guys. All in the next video, right, guys? Take care, and I'll see you all later. Okay, bye.